Hey, what's up? What's up, everyone? Welcome to the channel. T. Ravis here. And today, yes, today, we are finally going to open our Box Heroes Mystery Box for the month. This um, is the one to where I had requested to change from the bunch of the new variants um, to something new, or actually something old. Uh, the way they used to do it, and I was put on the list, and uh, I was told by them that, yes, indeed, I did get put on the list for the old book, and um, so let's see how they did. Let's open it up here, and let's see what we got. We got some uh, new stuff in here this month. Let's look. We got a, I got a Return of the Sinister Six trading card. That's kind of cool. I got a cool little Spider-Man sticker like that. Uh, got a sticker here. Looks like a Thor movie sticker. Got that. So it's kind of cool. Uh, and the card as usual. Right here. Got the card. And uh, some little extras there. I like that. Uh, let's see. Got a good little stack of books. Empty there. And let's get these... Baby's unwrapped. I don't care what you say about box heroes. The way they box and wrap and package their stuff in Mylar, awesome. You can never, you may get a crappy book, but by gosh, it's in a dang Mylar and it looks good in there. So I'm going to flip this book around here. So uh, I'm going to stick it to the bottom because that is our subscriber bonus book and i'm gonna put it down there all right here we go first book ah, looks like the venom uh venom 32 the alien versus predator variant so i have this but it's awesome cover and uh not bad let's see what we got here ah, it looks like uh detective number 489 Two Batman, uh, it's got Batgirl, Batman, uh, it's when they had those dollar books, it's a dollar issue, so, nice shape, really nice shape, not bad, I am a Batman fan, so, happy with that, whoa, look at there, Spectacular Spider-Man 203, part 13 and 14 of Maximum Carnage, so there you go, that's good, it's in, uh, got a little thing in the corner but overall it's a really nice shaped book so that's uh thumbs up for me oh look at there another spider-man spider-man 274 i believe this one has a gatefold cover on it it's the secret wars uh, uh, uh issue and uh another really good shape yeah so all right so far so good Well, look at there. Heroes Incorporated, um, number one. Now, this book here was by Wally Wood. And uh, he went out to do his own company after leaving EC. And I believe, uh, I, I think he did Daredevil after this. I'm pretty sure he did with Marvel. Or maybe it's right in that time frame. But anyway, um Heralds Incorporated presents Canon, Amazing Adult Adventure. I have a copy of this, but um, it's a really nice copy, though. No spine ticks. Huh. It says Wallywood 1969, so this would be after the Daredevil run. This is after he left Marvel, and he was still going. I think he was doing Thunder Agents there for a while. Big run on Thunder Agents for Tower Comics. Some great stories there, too. So I'm all right with that, too. Look at there, Machine Man. Jack Kirby Goodness, number eight. Really nice copy. So this is a nice little Bronze Age Marvel. I am a Machine Man fan. Uh, I was working on putting a set of these together. I've got the first appearance where he appeared in 2000 AD. And uh, love the Barry, uh, Barry Windsor Smith miniseries he did back in the 80s. So I'm all right with that. Let's see. 
what do we have there? What is that? King Size Annual Doctor Strange number one. All right. All right, all right, all right. Look at that. So there that is. This looks like, yep, Phantom number one, Michael Turner. Don't have this. Love the art. You got to like Michael Turner. Um, it's a top cow book. So, I don't have it. I don't think I have it. So, I'm all right with that. And the last book. So, J. Scott Campbell, Variant Subscriber Bonus. Boom, look at that. Eternals, number one, the J. Scott Campbell variant. I didn't buy a single issue of this Eternals. There were so many covers. I think it was supposed to coincide with the release of the movie, because if I'm not mistaken, the original release of the movie is supposed to be around this time that this came out, or a little... I don't know. That's been so messed up. But I think they already had all this stuff in motion, so they went ahead with it. But that's a nice cover. Look at that. It's a beautiful. Of course, it's J. Scott Campbell, so usually he does a good cover. Let me try to get this glare down on you. Look at that. So I'm all right with that, too. So um, let's do a little uh, little fast. Uh, there you go. I got uh, Venom number 32, the Alien variant. This has been my favorite one so far, though. So I got that. Phantom number one. Doctor Strange King Size Annual number one. And that's a really nice shape, too. Machine Man number eight. Some good Jack Kirby stuff. Cannon number one. Amazing Spider-Man 274. Uh, Spectacular Spider-Man number 203. And it is a newsstand. And this would be the year 1993. So in 93, let me look at my little guide. Uh, 93, there would have been anywhere from 10 to 15% of newsstands. The rest of the books would have been direct market. So, this new stand in this shape, I mean, let me look at it a little closer. Has one little, it's not a spine tick, it's like a little dash of the color in the black there. But everything else looks amazing as far as condition. Uh, let me get that a little closer there. See, look at that spine. So, hey. That's a really good one. And the one DC book in here. I'm all right with DC. I like DC. Detective Comics right there. Uh, what was that? 289. Don't know about anything in this book. I'm sure there's not. But uh, there's also an Adam story in here. It says Batman. Uh, two Batman novelties uh, plus uh, Commissioner Gordon and his first solo story. Uh, novel length Robin Batgirl story. And an Adam in a mini epic. So it has quite a few stories in there. Featuring the entire Batman family. So I'm alright with that too. And the last one was uh, my subscriber bonus book. Was the Eternals number one. J. Scott Campbell. So alright. Um, Boxed Heroes. Double thumbs up for that one. Um, I am really happy. I'm happy with that book. Uh, this box. Maybe someone else wouldn't. This wouldn't be their cup of tea, but this is right up my alley. So, um, definitely looking forward to next month. And you know what? They did what they said. I was very impressed. Uh, I had misses, had made a comment on Instagram about, you know, they had switched these boxes to mostly new modern variants and all that. And I, I wasn't, I, I was, it's, you know, I like some modern variants and I buy modern. I pick up books every week. But uh, to me, this is, this is my stuff right here. The older stuff I like to put together. And, um, so, um, I had messaged them and it wasn't five minutes after I had, well, I commented on their, on their, uh, Instagram page and it wasn't five minutes. They answered me back and we had talked and then he messaged me and I was like, Hey, you know, he's like, oh, I, there's another list I can put you on. We get older books. And I'm like, Hey, all right, put me on that list. And then, um, 
you know, it come time and they, you know, I'm on to make subscription. So my subscription came out and paid, they got paid. And usually it takes maybe up to a week once they get paid. I know they got a lot and they have to get it in motion and get things put together and sent out and all that. But usually it's about a week. Well, two weeks went by, nothing, nothing at all. And I messaged them and said, hey, you know, you took my money two weeks ago, blah, 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 what's going on? And um, they made, you know, they said, well, you know, uh, they've had a, between uh, the pandemic and everything, it's hit them, and it, it could have hit them hard, who knows? They could have lost half their warehouse people or the people who do this or wherever they do this out of, and it could have wiped them out and he got them behind. It could have. I mean, Lord knows the where I work, it's happened too, and we've all been uh, buckled down and, and done that. So I, I understand that, but when they shipped it, it shipped, and it got here like three days. I was happy about that. So, all right, that's it. Uh, that's my Box Heroes box. Um, appreciate you taking time out of your day to check it out. Um um, right now, I'm sitting at a one ninety nine on subscribers. One more to two hundred. I get to two hundred. Um, I'm going to be doing a um, two fifty giveaway, so I'll be posting a separate video for that once I get to two hundred. Um, going to get some stuff together and do a video for that, and that'll be my video that people comment on that I'll draw the winner from when we hit two fifty, and uh, just appreciate it. So remember, collect what you like. Thank you.